Ola TV show brought to you by In Health Mutual and presented by Elva Carroll Grove City. Hola, ¿qué tal amigos de Hola TV Show? Les saluda su amiga Jennifer y bienvenidos al programa de hoy. What's up guys? It's Keisha and welcome back to Hola TV. Hoy les tenemos un programazo preparado para todos ustedes porque si se perdieron la semana de la moda en Columbus, Fashion Week Columbus, les traemos un acceso exclusivo al detrás de escenarios en el Model Lounge presentado por Charles Pinzone Salons. And not only are we taking you backstage at Columbus Fashion Week, but we're also going to be telling you how you can sign up with Ohio's fastest growing health insurance company, In Health Mutual. Esto y mucho más hoy en Hola, Hola TV, TV Show. Siento que te estoy viendo. Ya no aguanto, me tienes mal. Tú te has convertido a mí en adicto de todas tus redes. Porque cada vez que me levanto pienso en ti. A ver tus fotos y para dónde te mueves. Tú me has convertido a mí en adicto de todas tus redes. Porque cada vez que me levanto. We would like to thank Fashion Week Columbus for allowing us all access backstage at the exclusive model launch presented by Charles Pinzone Salons. That's right, Jen. Not only were Melody and I on the front lines interviewing you all as you entered the amazing Columbus Fashion Week event, but Jen got to go backstage and talk to some of the designers, a couple of the headliners, as well as some of the models to see how they're handling all the excitement of Columbus Fashion Week. I can't wait to show you guys the footage that we did. We talked to Stevie Boy, who designed for celebrities such as Lady Gaga, and David Tupas, who's designed for celebrities such as Taylor Swift. This and many more interesting people, very nice and talented people that we met at the Backstage Lounge. So let's not waste any more time and let's go check it out. What's up guys, it's Keisha and Melody and tonight we're welcoming you to the 2015 Columbus Fashion Week finale. Yeah. We know you guys have been waiting all year for this event so we're here to bring you the latest, the greatest with your guys' styles and trends as well as the designers. I can't wait to see what's going to be walking on the runway tonight so let's get started. Let's do it. What's up guys? We're here with Erin Maloney, the ever so fabulous model coordinator for Columbus Fashion Week. It's been a year's worth of planning, so I'm just excited to be able to sit and watch the show and actually breathe and yeah, see all the everything that we've done. Everything looks amazing, so I'm super excited. The makeup looked amazing. The hair looked amazing. Tell me, guys, how was it? It was all totally worth it. It's always fun when it's back there and everybody's kind of running around. It's a little chaotic, but it's always a great time. What was your guys' favorite style to do for what designer? My favorite probably was Stephanie Foster. It was like a cat eye with a burgundy lip. It was gorgeous. I think my favorite was uh, Joan because hers was more evening wear, so it was more updo, something a little fancier. What's popular right now? What's popular for hair? What's popular for makeup? What should we be doing right now? Um, I think for hair, a lot of textures in right now. We did show a lot of sleek looks on the runway today, but for the average person, um, natural curl, a wavier style, and going a little darker than bright blonde. So for fall, like going just a little bit more poppy or a little more red, and adding a lot more texture. So deal. And what about makeup? Makeup is usually it's always like a smoky eye and the burgundy lips, just doing darker colors. So guys, we're here with Jeff, the style director for the Alternative Fashion Mob. So Jeff, we're so excited to have you here tonight, and your outfit is amazing. Now, for Columbus Fashion Week, what are you looking forward to the most seeing out there on the runway? I'm looking forward to seeing most of the designers. I've not seen any of them before, so that's very exciting. And I know a lot of the ladies and gentlemen that are walking, so I'm excited to see what they do. And you do Alternative Fashion Week. What can I expect for 2016? You know, we hopefully we're going to have a lot more newer designers this year, some returning people. And, you know, we have ladies and gentlemen from all ages. So 
last year up to the age of 60. We're looking to hopefully have some ladies in their 70s and 80s this year. Awesome, and tattoos and piercings are allowed, right? Absolutely. Good deal. So I celebrating one of the most anticipated nights in Columbus, in Fashion Week Columbus 2015. And with us, we have Steve Lab. How are you? I'm good, thanks for having me. Steve, we're so excited to have you here in Columbus. Of course, we're learning so much from you. And like I said, we're just so excited. But tell me, what do you think about Columbus Fashion Week? I've done Fashion Week for nine years so far, and I've never met a more together group of people. Everybody here is wonderful to work with. Everybody here is fully competent, from the lighting to the volunteers to the stagehands to the directors. It just makes it so easy. The show's going on right now, and I'm doing this. Yes! There's, there's not much to do. They're just so good, so I feel kind of guilty. So I'm probably going to go back out there and do something soon and help with the beautiful finale. Thank you, Steve, so much. Thank you. Mwah, such a pleasure. And don't go anywhere because we'll be right back with a lot more designers, models, producers. So stay tuned. There's something for everyone. Serving all 88 counties of Ohio, In Health Mutual is Ohio's only health insurance co op. In Health Mutual, we were built for you. Boy, I'm hungry. Looking for a place to eat, but don't know where to go. Stop what you're doing and come to El Vaquero. Feeling hungry? Come to El Vaquero and try our three-course dinner special. Start off with your choice of super salad, then choose from our six delicious entrees. Top it all off with our delicious desserts, all for $12.99. Only at El Vaquero, the most authentic Mexican food you can get without a passport. Visit us at albaquerorestaurants.com for more detail. Hola TV Show brought to you by In Health Mutual and presented by El Vaquero Grove City. Hey guys, so we're here with Bob from Worthington Jewelers, one of the headline sponsors with tonight's event. So Bob, tell us, how are you feeling tonight? Are you excited to see the show? I'm feeling fantastic. This new venue is so exciting, and, and the people lining the halls, uh, the models uh, abound throughout the building. I've got beautiful ladies here. I couldn't be any happier. This new venue is just perfect. The bridal show that was here earlier in the week was unbelievable. Uh, it's it's just a great event. We love supporting it. So we're here with Thomas McClure, the executive director and founder of Columbus Fashion Week, and also we can't forget our very own fashion expert for Ola Columbus Ola TV show. So, Thomas, you look amazing, as always. So tell us what inspired your look for tonight. Very simple and classic with a little bit of a signature look. Because if you look at my shoes, that's a statement piece right there. And that just makes up the rest of this. Because this is all just simple and classy. So you worked from the foundation up. That's right. That is right. That is very smart. So who are you looking forward to seeing going down the runway the most tonight? You know, honestly, we have some amazing designers this year. 
Our headline designers, of course, Stevie Boy and David Tupaz, who are on complete opposite spectrum, ends of the spectrum. But then we have our local designers like Kevin Black and Joan Madison, Ludna Nahar. I mean, we have so many amazing designs, so I really can't choose one, but I will say this. I am looking forward to Stevie Boy opening the show because it's going to be a little edgy. Well, if Thomas McClure is saying it's going to be edgy, you can guarantee it's going to be edgy. I see the future of fashion revolving completely around me and uh, being a narcissistic person. Bloop, bloop. I've been a queen, shine through as our last blast eyes pierce the room. Letting our inner beauty shine through as our eyes. Baby, we're so happy to have you here, especially in Columbus. Tell me, how's your experience so far at Fashion Week Columbus 2015? I'm very happy. Very I'm very, excited. very happy. And I would only wish and I behoove every other designer to come here and to be a part of this situation. What would be one advice that you would give to young designers out there that would like to make it in the fashion industry? Save your money. Save your money. Just chill out. Save your money. Just enjoy life. Thank you, Steven. That's and that's a great advice. Tia, yeah, tell me, how's it been like working with Stevie? Stevie is amazing. First time we talk, we talk for hours and and we're just so happy to have him here. He's been so great to work with. The models love him. The runway loved him. So it's been amazing. I hope he'll come back. Thank you guys. Thank Woo! You. That's yeah. fabulous. <laughs> Hey guys, we continue the party, bringing you exclusive all-access backstage at Fashion Week Columbus 2015, and with us, the one and only David Tupas. How did you feel seeing your designs walking down the runway here in Columbus? Well, it's my first time in Columbus, Ohio. I never really know what to expect with regards to fashion taste. I've done New York, I've done LA, I've done all the other great cities, uh, Fashion Week for so many years. And so since everything went on the runway, how did you think the show went? Well, I'm surprised I got a standing ovation from for the first time showing in Columbus, Ohio. So I think the Columbus crowd liked what they saw. <laughs> yes, of course. Most of my collection is inspired from old Hollywood. It, it, that's my aesthetic. As you notice, most of these dresses have Audrey Hepburn inspiration. That was such a great success. Baby, thank you again for being here with us at Ola TV Show, brought to you by Charles Pinson, All Access Backstage for Fashion Week Columbus. Thank you for having me. And I can't wait. Hopefully, we'll see you in the future. Of course, definitely. I think this is my second home now. Yes, yes. we are glad to hear that. Woo! <laughs> Fashion Week Columbus, always an amazing event and one of the most anticipated events of the year. Definitely. Thank you, Keisha, and thank you, Fashion Week Columbus, for allowing us once again to cover the event this year. Well, guys, that's all we have for today's show. We really hope you enjoyed it, but we can't leave today without thanking our wonderful sponsors, New York & Company, for providing my looks for this and every show, as well as the CCAD for providing the stage show for Columbus Fashion Week. Bueno chicos, eso ha sido todo por hoy. Espero que hayan disfrutado el programa. Encuéntrenos en social media en Hola TV Show y también online en holacolumbus.com. Muchas gracias a nuestros sponsors. Thank you to our sponsors In Health Mutual and El Vaquero in Grove City, as well as Charles Pinzon Salons for making possible the backstage model lounge at Fashion Week Columbus, exclusive all access backstage. And we'll see you next time here on Hola TV Show. Chapaleones, Cotito el Bambino, el patrón. Oye, regresamos porque tenían el género en déficit. <risa> Llegaron los de rating, el patrón. Hay society, Chencho, la alta jerarquía, Nero, hey, sencillamente.
la sociedad del dinero, los ricos y famosos, alta jerarquía.